Today's job is just for relaxation, boys. There's an import firm that brings in lots of luxury goods from around the world. Yesterday, another boatload of goods came into the harbor, and I have a taste for a few of the items on the list. What do they got that we don't have, sir? Well, I haven't smoked a decent cigar in a long time, and they have almost a ton of them. Cigars? Yeah, cigars. Something strange about that? Customers in our nightclubs are interested in good quality cigars, but they're expensive and difficult to get. If we manage to get a truck full of the best cigars, we could make as much money as we would off a bank job. What? Oh my God, just bring me a truckload. Paulie, explain it to them. Okay. It's like this. Polly, what the hell is going on? How the hell would I know, Tommy? I'd rather just snare a truck full of expensive cigars. The Don wants them and it makes us money. So it's up to us to get them. It just seems a bit small time for him. Forget about it, Tom. The cigars we gotta steal are packed in crates at the harbor. We need to get them to a truck and leave the harbor. But first, we have to get in. How do we do that? There's a tougher guard at the harbor now than when Morello was around. Exactly. Brute force won't work. So we're gonna play this one cool. We'll just nab one of the trucks while they're moving goods around the city. The trucks have signs on them that say Atlantic Import. We'll wait for one to come out of the harbor, follow it to a nice quiet place with no cops, then block its path. A few shots into the air or to get the driver out. Once we take his papers, one of us can get into the harbor. So we're gonna kill the poor bastard? Nah, it's too much hassle so long as we get him out and get everything he's got on him. You'll take the truck to the harbor, Tommy. Load it up with the crates of cigars, then we'll meet at the agreed place. I'll load them up alone, unload them alone, and then maybe I'll smoke a few. So what are you gonna do? We'll wait a little away from the harbor at the agreed place. If somebody starts tailing you, we'll deal with them. Then you take the truck to the handoff point. Yeah, right. How will I recognize these crates? We'll have a sign on that says Scorsese Import-Export. And the agreed place? We'll go there and I'll show you. Yeah. First we'll go there, and then we'll get the truck. So let's go. Hey, boy, so what'll it be? Get Tom here a bat and a gun, and get us two Thompsons. Okay. Yeah, thanks. Thanks, Vincenzo. Hey there, boys. I have something here for you. Something s special today. Yeah, I like it. Looks pretty good. You can g g g get into it this way. Yeah, okay. We can do that. Thanks, Ralphie. Hey, it's nothing. Since we're all here, I want to ask you about something. What's on your mind? Well, I got this idea. I might need you to do a little job with me. Oh, yeah? What's the deal? Well, it's a big deal, actually. 
I can't manage it alone. You're my good buddies. We know each other, you know? And Salieri? He know about this? Nah. He doesn't, and he doesn't need to know. He's already got enough money. So, what's it all about? Well, I was checking out this bank. What? What? Cool it. It's okay. This bank isn't too secure. It's just a little joint. At the end of the month, they always have a big pile of money in the safe. We'd be pretty loaded if we pulled it off. Or we'd all be dead. What's the matter with you? Besides, we got plenty of money. Bull, we ain't doing bad, but we sure aren't loaded. Salieri ain't a bad boss, but once in a while I like to make some decent dough on the side. Not some tiny share. Hmm. I'm not sure it's such a great plan, Polly. What do you say, Sam? Count me out. The family's pretty important to me. Yeah, right. You're probably right. Forget about it. I was just thinking out loud. Okay, good. Okay, I think it's time. I'll go get ready. I'll be back in a while. Tom, let's get to the hub. Now, we'll wait here for a truck and then follow it. We'll overtake it in a safe spot and take what we need. Papers and nothing will happen to you. Don't do it. Don't do it. I have a wife. I didn't do none of you. I don't have anything. Don't kill me. I had a wife and children. I'll meet Sam and we'll wait for you. Good luck, Tom. going? Why are you standing around doing nothing? We need all hands on deck today. I need you to take those crates down to the dispatch hall. I'm gonna go take a leak and it better be uh, done when I get uh, back. <laughs> uh, yes, Chief.
there someplace. Now we can finally see what's inside these crates. Good idea. Hope it didn't get damaged on the way. A few of them fell off. The cigars are smashed up. Well, it ain't so bad. This one's just bent, so we'll straighten it out. I messed that up. What the hell are you doing? What? I dropped a few things, nothing big. Hey, Box, what do you got inside? Christ! Tom, you ain't gonna believe this! What is it? What's inside those boxes? Damn, are you thinking what I'm thinking? Well, they don't look like cigars. Then it's definitely not rock candy. Those are diamonds, and a hell of a lot of them. What if they're just phonies? You know, they exchange cigars for mirrors, props, beads, stuff like that. I think only Columbus got away with that. 
These look like diamonds, Tom. There's a hell of a lot of them. I knew Salieri wouldn't risk so much for some damn cigars. Well, it looks like you were right. What do you want to do? Should we take them? What? You think we'd get away with it? Well, we could say that some crates got lost in the chase. Or you can forget that. That's bullshit. Put them back where you found them. I don't want to end up with a hole in my head. If we just took one or two each. And there's so many. Holy. Okay, okay, I'll put them back. What if Salieri doesn't even know about them? I think we can easily find out if he knows. How? Sam's bringing him here right now. Come, we'll see firsthand if he knows. Bravo, boys. You did it. You got a well-deserved bonus coming your way. Ah, one crate got broke, but it's nothing. Looks like these ones at the back are okay. Bravo, bravo. Boss, should we unload the crates and put the cigars into the warehouse? Uh, no, no, not yet. Anyway, why should you do it? I can get someone else. You want to work at my warehouse, too? <laughs> Now nah, go take it real easy, boys. Good work. Holly? Huh? I'll stop by tomorrow and we can talk about that little deal you mentioned. Yeah. Okay. Mm -hmm.